I'm Calvin Phillips with Campus Reform. Today we're at Marymount University reading offensive quotes to students and asking them if they think they're Joe Biden's or Donald Trump's. What they don't know is that all the quotes are actually Joe Biden. What will his supporters say when they find that out? Let's ask him. Who would you vote for in the presidential election between Donald Trump and Joe Biden? I would probably have to go with leadership, which is Joe Biden. Personally, I would go for Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Joe Biden. I have a few quotes for you here. I want you to guess who said them between Donald Trump or Joe Biden, all right? Okay. Somewhat controversial quotes from the past. First quote, you cannot go to a 7-Eleven or Dunkin' Donuts unless you have a slight Indian accent. Who do you think said that? Trump. Uh, Trump. <laughs> Sounds like a Trump quote. Cool. <laughs> That's a big yikes. But, uh, I might say Donald Trump. Uh, Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Next up, this was to a largely African-American audience. Quote, if my opponent wins, they're gonna put y'all back in chains. Trump again. <laughs> huh. Wow. <laughs> I still think that's Donald Trump. Oh, definitely Trump. Uh, Trump. Donald Trump. Hmm. Joe Biden. Next up, uh, this was about President Obama. He called him, quote, the first mainstream African American who is articulate and bright and clean. Uh, probably Trump. <laughs> I'll go Trump again. Who do you think said that? Uh, I think Trump said that. Donald Trump. What if I told you that all of those are actually Joe Biden? All right, there it is. <laughs> is that surprising? Yeah, very. <laughs> that's crazy. Is that surprising? Yeah. Oh, snap. Oh, oh that's bad. <laughs> is that surprising to you? Yeah, I mean, it's, they're all pretty racist, so it's not really good. Ah, well, that's surprising. That's really surprising. Why is that surprising? I've never heard any of those things before, so the fact that you told me that now I'm like, Damn, is he really who he say he is? I don't think that's something I want to yeah. uh, really support. Would this potentially impact your vote? Of course. And why is that? Well, I mean, like, since I thought all that was Trump, like, I thought, like, that was going to be a slam dunk. But apparently, you know, I got to reconsider that. So I'll just look more in depth, really. Would these quotes potentially lead you to another candidate? Yeah, I mean, definitely, absolutely. Personally, uh, probably. Like, I, I would have to really do my research. Yeah, I, th I think it would. Would these quotes impact your potential support of him? Mm, yes. I'm surprised. 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 Why is that surprising? Um, because then you would hear a lot of media, you know, saying Trump usually is the one targeting and making fun of the other classes. Uh, but then you see Joe Biden making some executive decisions when he was vice president that. You didn't really see in, in television, so I guess to a point, I guess media does play a role. I'm Kevin Phillips with Campus Reform. Thanks so much for watching. If you want to donate to help us make more videos just like that, you can click right here. And if you want to be the first person to see all of our new content, click the subscribe button right here. Please click one of them. Doesn't have to be both. One or the other. Okay. Thanks.